Welcome back to Let's Play Psychonauts. I'm Nye, and we are back in the Brain Tumbler experiment. Uh, we spent some time in Sasha Nine's lab last episode and got ourselves the ability to shoot Psy Blasts. Uh, and so now we're going to be exercising that ability to explore this really creepy meat based area. And that is something attacking me from a lo really long ways away. I'm actually standing here because there was the, a. Um, uh, there was a figment that I saw earlier that I haven't quite picked up yet. There's those side blasts in action if you weren't watching last episode. So now we have projectile attack. Okay, where... I was so sure I saw this other figment in this general area. Hmm. I might be wrong. You know, it's been known to happen. I've been known to be wrong. What I think I uh, know, though, is I think we have to go back and do the upper route, because I think that it went further, and I completely missed it. Which uh, I think I've done on just about every single run through of this area I've ever done. Make our jump here. Come on, Raz. Let's do it. There we go. Okay, am I, am I wrong, or is Raz's voice uh, Invader Zim? I think I'm right. And something I'm just kind of noticing now, and that I've probably noticed in the past and just never uh, put a lot of uh, thought into, but I'm just noticing it as he jumps. You can really hear it there. See, can you, can you see the figment, that yellow one? Yeah. Okay, I don't know if I can make this jump. Yes, I can. Awesome. Jump onto another thing. Awesome. Let's get around here. I can barely see due to the way the camera's acting here. Excellent. Got ourselves more emotional baggage sorted. Got ourselves another, uh, ow. Actually, that doesn't actually deal any damage. We got that taken care of. Uh, we got ourselves a devil plant to take care of. Awesome. That's taken care of. Gonna keep to, uh, keep to the high route as long as possible. It looks like I'm actually at the end of it now uh, with that baggage. So I'm gonna start uh, backtracking a little bit, snag some of these figments, and by some I mean the small handful that we actually have here. We have just earned the upgraded Palm Mega Bomb. Uh, what this allows us to do is uh, we can charge up the uh, Palm Bomb up in midair. So that's a normal bomb right there, but when you see it go hands around, you know I've been charging up. Okay, where is that yellow figment I saw? There it is. It's up there. Come on. Come here. Awesome. We got it. Okay. I think that is absolutely all of the uh, figments up until this point, so we are going to move on. And let's keep following that rabbit. Oh god, would you guys just go away? You know what? Palm bomb. Oh, okay. You know, that that's fine too. You go away. I'm not dealing with exploding assholes today. I already had to deal with that at my job. You don't want to know what my job is. Okay. Let's get some health going here. Good. And let's keep on exploring. You! Go away. I hate these things. I hate them so much, because I don't think you can actually hit them until after they hit you, which is obnoxious. Let's get that health right there. Oop. Hey, it's another one of these things. Awesome. You know what those look like to me? You don't... I... I don't even want to say it. It has to do with a webcomic, but you know, I'm, I'm going to leave it at that. Hey, hey, hey. Where'd that come from? You. No. I just killed two guys with one side blast, and that is a really cool thing. Hey, look, there's another one. Nope. Get back here. Awesome. We're starting to see some more nautical themed uh, figments here. Did I catch all the ones back here? Do I have to worry about this? You know, you can see with the awesome upgrades we've been getting, I kind of want to get all the figments. Everything I can get, I want to collect it all. And we have a ship here. Uh, named the Oblong something or other. Could that be Oblongata, maybe? Possibly, I don't know. Uh, let's see, we have this seems to be bad meat, and hitting it causes it to let off. Ugh. I don't even want to know what that is. Let's see, can I, can I get that? Yes, yes I can, awesome. 
And Little boy, I am sorry hmm. to say that you have a very serious mental problem. The trouble originates in this area, here. The area that we in the medical profession like to refer to as the brain. You see, son, it's just no good. Usually mental problems do start the so brain. Blunt, but you have the insanity of a manatee. Oh, the huge manatee. People are always saying that. What do you think's wrong with my brain, doctor? It's just a bad... How should I know? I'm a dentist. But here's what I do know. If a tooth is bad, you pull it. Oh, God, he isn't saying what I think he's saying. Yep, mad brain's got to come out, boy. It's the quickest way to cure what you've oh, got. Oh, God. Insanity of the mind. Where else would the insanity be? Now hold still. This will only hurt until your brains come flying out. Man, that is so uh, reassuring. Don't worry, Dogen. I'm coming up there to save you. What is wrong, Rasputin? Hmm. No time to explain, Sasha. I gotta climb the spooky thorn tower. Spooky thorn tower, okay. Wow, the even the figments have gotten spookier. Now we're looking at uh, uh, grave markers. Got it. Okay, got all the mental cobwebs. Good. I like that. Uh, let's explore more around the base of the tower. We got bulls down here. Okay. Uh, I do see a uh, luggage over here. I think this might be the final piece of emotional baggage. It'll tell me if it was. Yep, that was it. I have, I don't even know what that is. Got some more vine figments. This is good stuff. Our maximum projection depth has increased now that we have gotten one of those. Uh, I want to say there's one of those in every level, but I'm not so sure about that. Uh, we are missing a couple figments, but you know, that's understandable. Okay, hold on. We got a save here. Let's go. Let's go see if we can catch this thing. Come here, you. It's breaking stuff. Stop breaking things. Oh, come on, that was that was just cheap. You! Come here! Okay, what are we gonna see in here? The world shall taste my eggs. Okay, there are eggs. And it hatches... into something I cannot identify. And it runs to the edge of a, um, okay? And it rides a fish. It rides a fish to an amusement park, and then spins in the teacup ride... before killing everything. Okay, what the hell was that? I'm seeing some crazy stuff in here, Sasha. This can't be right. Ugh, why did I buy the cheap brain tumbler? The cheap brain tum- Sasha, we gotta have a talk, you and me. Okay, I don't want to continue up that way because, uh, there's a couple more figments I haven't quite grabbed. So let's see if we can grab those before we move on up. But yeah, we're getting the first hints that something's just not quite right in this world. And by first hints, I mean we've been noticing this for a while. Could be the bunny we've been following. Uh, could be the weird evil crap that I've been having to fight off as we move our way through here. Uh, I mean, personally, I think it might have something to do with all the hanging meat everywhere. But, um, yeah, that's just me. Okay, how many figments am I missing? We are missing eight figments. Nope, go away. Okay, there's one. There's number two. Push number three, jump over that vine. No, jump. Thank you, Raz. Keep on grabbing these and. There's no way to get any higher. That's you bad. You must use your levitation power. I don't have that. I don't know how to levitate. And now we get pulled out because apparently we're useless. I have no idea you were at such a remedial level. Hey. Lucky for Rubini, you, we have he? one of the world's foremost levitators on staff. Yes, we do. Jet Mia Vodello. The mental minx. Oh, God. Precisely. You'll need this oarsman's badge to reach her at the docks. Hey, I've been wanting I'll one try to determine where this interference is coming from. Return when you've earned your levitation merit badge. Oh, if I must. Okay, so that's all we can accomplish in this area, unfortunately. So we're gonna have to leave. But that's fine, because I had other stuff I wanted to do anyways. Let's just jump inside this tree trunk, which is Where mysteriously inside this very somewhat a little bit clean lab, and head over to the sanctuary. Yes. Because uh, I think uh, our friend here wants to t give us something. Ford, would you? Do you have something for me? In recognition of your hard work, dedication, and mental agility, I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for invisibility. 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 Neat. 
Man, we're just getting merit badges everywhere. This is fantastic. Yeah, the eyes do glow. Okay, let's play a game. No! Look out! Another sensor! Blast it! Oh no, you're out of ammo! Punch it! No, I'm not! You are now! Here are the rules. Take this guy out. But if he sees you at all, you lose. Go get him! Okay, well, let's see. That's uh, my invisibility hey, right there. Where'd he go? Careful now. Do 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 do. Neat. Oh, well done. Now that's the power of invisibility. Yeah, it allows you to go invisible. I think I've heard the kids around camp refer to this technique as uh, silent but deadly. I think that refers to something uh... else. Yep, now we can go invisible. Bobo. Hey, not bad. If you didn't eat so much garlic, I wouldn't even know you were here. It just lasts for a while and then it has to recharge. <gasps> Okay, so we need to go and use some of our mental cobwebs. So this is how that works. Cards, 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 cards. I can't remember how many cards you get per cobweb. I think it's just one per. But uh, awesome. So now we can uh, rank up a couple of more times. Uh, I think we're going to want to do that, too. You only put side I still need to buy side cards in there. Nothing else. Understand? Challenge markers. Okay, I'm hearing too many voices at once, and in this game, hearing voices is usually a bad thing. So I need to go and get myself some more chi side challenge markers, so let's go do that. Uh, because I think we can very swiftly get ourselves to rank, uh, 40, which is... Guys, I, this is like being power leveled. I feel like I'm munchkinning this. I mean, the game still comes down to skill 9 times out of 10, but, uh, I kind of feel like I'm munchkinning this. Okay, let's get ourselves to the main lodge. We're going to go buy those real quick, and then we're going to return. We're going to go actually get ourselves the two more ranks, and then we can start exploring again. Uh, we actually have the ability to snag ourselves uh, another scavenger hunt item, and then we can go into uh, the uh, lake now, or the lakeside area, and actually snag a couple of more cards there, because now we have the ability to use the oarsman's, oarsman's badge. Hey, anything to take? Now, that but I want to buy, uh, let's see, okay. I need a couple of these. What else can I do you for? While I am here, while I can buy what them, I'm just going to buy, like, for? five of these things. What else can I do you for? Unfortunately, I can't choose to, you know, buy multiples at once. Okay. You know, it's kind of weird. Uh, these guys are not here. You know, there's no, uh, there's no one practicing here, and there's no invisible girl who gets pissed anytime I get close. Kind of odd. Maybe I should get close to her and use invisibility, too. Hmm. Okay. Let's head back to uh, the uh, secret hideout place real quick. Well. Okay, let's go to the sanctuary real quick. And then we're going to snag... Uh, I did my math wrong, didn't I? I think I did my math wrong. Yeah, I can only get one rank. Which sucks. I thought I could get two. I can only get one. But hey, you know, one's better than none, right? Neat. We get the Psy Blast upgrade at 40. That's actually something I was just complaining about, uh, not having enough power behind that thing. So being able to get that upgrade this fast, it's pretty fantastic. Okay, let's uh, let's continue. You know, we got time. So we're going to make our way down to the lake. Yeah. I like this chair. It reminds me of the chair from Casper. Okay, so now what I get to do... Is watch Dogen, Dogen just walk out of the lake. Are you okay? I had the strangest machine induced dream about you. TV? Well, first of all, Sasha 9 invited me down to a secret lab and. Is it just me or are they having two different conversations again? Oh dear. You He's can see right through his head. Brainless. The dream was true. Dogen, don't worry. I know what your brains are. They're in. Like this crazy dream thorn bush straight jacket tower place. Uh huh. Zach. You go to the TV lounge. I'm on the case. I just need a little more advanced training to prepare. Yeah, that's um, that's the word I would use. Okay. We need advanced training. I can do advanced training. Okay, let's uh, let's go talk to uh, Admiral Crawler. Check it out, Admiral. 
I'm an oarsman, first class. Give me a boat. Hey, it looks like all those weeks in the canoe simulator really paid off. Canoe uh, simulator? Yes, sir, Admiral, sir. Well, let's get you afloat. Thank you. I appreciate it. Finest of the fleet. I'll take good care of her, sir. You better. The lake isn't as peaceful or as harmless as she looks. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, don't take her out too far. That would be disastrous. Okay. Uh, no, you don't. Am I allowed to go this direction? What's that round thing up on the dock? It's a diving that bell. Thing? Oh, man. Let me tell you about that thing. That thing is none of your stinking business. Man, these guys are just so mature and intelligent, and uh, I'm actually not allowed to pass them. So instead, we're going to get in this boat. Now that is how to paddle a boat. With your mind. Okay, can I... Okay, I want to get out. I want to get out. I want to get, get that. Let me out. Ugh. Are we even touching I'm the ground? Asking. I'm just trying to find out. Yes. Look, who is this? Is he on a phone? No. I'm trying to talk to that first guy. Okay. Let's Where's see. This going? is how I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna cheat. Now, can I do the same thing over here? Nope, it's not gonna allow me in. I hope you're all I just wanted to tell you that we are having a party out here on the floating dock, and I'd love for you all to come. It's you okay, Raz? It's raining, baby, and it's fun, fun, fun. Just grab a canoe and come join the party. Okay, let's go grab a canoe. Shut up. Okay, apparently I'm not allowed to go there. He's talking to fish? That doesn't seem good. So we're going to go join the levitation party, but i got to get my canoe back first. But, you know. There ain't no part like it like a levitation party. And in fact, it's going to prove itself Bobby. pretty true. Okay, let's go ahead and make it this way. So I can't actually get that uh, particular card just yet. Shame as that may be. Okay, let's make our way over to the floating dock over here. Hey, guys. I'm here. The party hasn't started yet, I'm, but, I, but I'm here now, so we can start. As soon as I figure out how to get off this damn boat. There we go. Hey, look, everybody's having fun. There she is. She's levitating and already. There you are, darling. Don't worry. I got in contact with your father, and he's going to be here tomorrow to pick you up. Oh dear. My father. You were not supposed to do that. Oh, go to go. The race is starting. What race? I want to be part of it. Lily. Oh, hey, Raz. She comes out of it really Listen, fast. I made you something. It's kind of stupid, but they stole Dogen's brains. She made us something. No, he's just like that. I had a nightmare with And we're mad worried about Dogen's brain. He's going to take them out. And was it a creepy looking freak with a shower cap and a stainless steel three-pronged claw? Wait, hey, you know this person? That's my nightmare. It's so a shared it's nightmare. Not just me. Oh god, collective but unconscious. How? And why all the meat? I don't know. God, she knows but all I of this. Think it's time I find out where this is coming from. Wait, don't go off on your own. That's bad. Let's rendezvous tonight at the old boathouse for debriefing. And a makeout this session? So cool. Yeah, it feels like that time in True Psychic Tales 314 where... Nerds! Shut up! Okay, then. Man, she, what, what, does she have a, uh... Uh... I'd love to make this joke, but I can't remember the name of that motorboat engine, so we're gonna move on. Just, you know, think the rescuers. Okay, well. We could go and we could get levitation training, but that could take some time, and that deserves an episode unto itself. So we're going to stop here. We made some good progress. Sort of, kind of, a little bit, not really. But hey, you know what? I'm going to say there was progress in that last episode. I will see you guys next time.